hate when my emotional girlfriend cries. I hate crying. It's the one thing in the entire world that I can't stand. Crying makes you weak. I was taught at a young age that guys who cry are just PCs who like to be dominated by their girlfriends, and I made sure never to let that happen to me. I met my girlfriend a year ago and we've been together for 8 months. She is everything a man can ask for. Submissive, petite, and feminine. The only thing about her that just turns me off is her crying. My girlfriend is a very sensitive woman who likes to cry over anything. Generally, I am okay with her crying as long as it's not done in public. Whenever she cries, I will ask her to go to a more secluded place with me because a grown man with a crying woman is embarrassing. My girlfriend cried at her sister's graduation or when her brother became a father for the first time. Although I let her cry, I was always thinking to myself that what she was doing was unnecessary. This month I had to go to a funeral. My older brother passed away after his long battle with cancer. He left behind his wife and 3 kids. Where I'm from, a funeral wake is held for over 3 days and in those 3 days all the family comes together to mourn. On the first day, my youngest niece cried for her dad to return. When my sister-in-law managed to calm her down, she asked us not to cry at the funeral or at least do it outside because she didn't want to trigger her daughter more. I could tell she was putting a strong front on to take care of her family and I admired that. I told my girlfriend what my sister-in-law requested from us and I expected her to listen. However, when we got to the wake, my girlfriend started crying within 10 minutes of being there. Because of this, my niece, who saw her cry, began to cry as well. I dragged my girlfriend outside. I didn't raise my voice, but she could tell I was very angry with her. I asked her why she was crying even after my sister-in-law and I told her not to cry. She was shocked that I asked her that question and told me she couldn't help it. Every single time she is at a funeral she can't help but cry as it is such a sad event. I was so pissed at her answer and yelled at her saying you're not the one who lost someone. You're not the one who had a brother pass away to cancer. It's not a crying marathon and you just made TH situation worse leave. She was shocked that I said that, but I just had enough of her behavior. She ended up leaving and I expected her to be at home once the wake finished, but she took her stuff from my apartment and hasn't called me since. I don't want to lose her. How do I get her back? 